Hey, um, I got an email recently, just a few days ago, from a parent who was a little nervous about his son, six year old, starting his first um, tennis tournament. His big concern actually is his son not to lose and, and just ha have a bad experience. And I would like to tell you the story of my first tournament, tournament match ever, which didn't go too well, all right? So here's how, how it happened. I was obviously a child and I was a, a local little champion because my brother and I, we were uh, the first that start, started uh, to play tennis and we were kind of dominating uh, the tennis locally. And I thought it was a time to take it to, uh, to uh, a national level, so to compete in a, in a bigger tournament. So we thought we were, gonna do, we were going to do okay. So we got uh, to the tournament uh, venue. I was about to uh, start my match in like half hour, I, 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 I think. I was a kid. I thought I was good. I was very confident, which is great. So my father, who was the coach, uh, who was my coach at that time, said, why don't you go and, and hit a little bit against the, uh, the wall just to warm up? And I did that. So I went to, to look for the place where they, they had the, the, the heating wall. And I saw over there a little kid. By the way, I didn't know who my, uh, my opponent was going to be. And I saw a kid hitting against the wall. He was just hitting slices and he was just pushing the ball. He was just warming up. He was feeling the ball. And I looked at him and like I said, he was, he was smaller than me. And I asked him, hey, are you playing in, the, in this tournament? He said, yes. And said, what's your name? And I asked him. And he told me his name and that's that's the first, that's when i found out that this kid was going to be my uh, my opponent and i saw him hitting just slowly and then i took a ball and i wanted to impress my future opponent I started to hit hard right forehands backhands and every, everything from uh, i mean uh, against the wall and w when this kid was just hitting slowly and after like hitting like two or three two three minutes i just felt confident i went to my father to tell him uh, who i'm going to play i'm going to play this little kid who hits the ball very slowly and I pretty much made fun of him because I thought he was, I was going to have an, an easy match against him. Well, the match came and this kid just beat me. He just beat me easily, like 6-0, 6-0. By the way, at that time when I was a kid, we, we didn't have a quick start tennis or a 10 and under. We just played full matches, best uh, out of three. So he beat me 6-0, 6-0. He just, he didn't hit hard, but he didn't have to. He had such a tremendous control of his, uh, of his uh, uh, racket and, and the ball. He was just moving the ball side to side. He was just making me run and he was hitting drop shots. He was hitting, he was hitting lobs. He was just having a good time. He was smiling all the time while playing me. He just, he just, <laughs> he was just toying with me. So what did I learn from this one? Did I feel humiliated? Yes, I did. Did I have a bad experience? Yes, I did. But, but because it was my first match, I actually didn't feel like, oh, I'm not gonna play tennis again because look, there are other kids better than me. Instead, what, I, what I, I learned was that I should never underestimate my opponent. So basically, if you are a parent who is going to, um, to take their children for the first time, at the tournament or if you're just a player go, going for a tournament just go there to have fun get a good experience learn practice your skills don't focus too much on winning or losing accept that losing is, is part of the the process winning losing it's not that important of course it makes you feel good when you're when you win but it's mostly about just get some match play meet some new people and enjoy the process, all right? So don't emphasize uh, winning, don't worry about losing, just go there and enjoy it.